bag just came off. No, I don't think I hit you at all. I think it came off. Well, you know, you hit you hit the bag for sure, but I think it just came off. Okay. If you want to look around and double check, though. Do what? Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure it just came off. Okay. Sorry about that. Have a good one. My name is Randall Ray and welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be more motorcycle related so I just wanted to uh, give you guys a heads up. I did mention uh, in my last workshop update I was going to be including more motorcycle content and stuff like that. But um, yeah, I just want to shed some light on a potential major issue with running hard bags with quarter turn pins. Now I wasn't aware that um, these pins actually wear out. so. I'm talking about here is this system the Harley uses which is a metal plate with a spring it mounts on the bike pin goes through the hard bag attaches the spring and it just twists into place now that's not gonna go anywhere right but apparently these pins do wear now I was I was unaware of that I've only taken my bags off a handful of times and the last thing when I put my apes on my bike took them off and to get it into the shop install everything wheel it back out, put the bags on, away I went. Now, <clears throat> following that, the next day I did take a trip up to Rockstar Harley in Fort Myers. On my way up there, I was in traffic. Luckily, I was in traffic, you know, traffic and I wasn't really going at an incredible rate of speed, but my bag came off. Unfortunately, one of the pins was worn out, apparently. It did come off. Now, I was only about 20 minutes in my ride, had another 25, 35 minutes to go. I kept stopping every 10 to 15 minutes, just checking the bags, checking the pin. Several times the pin was loose or had already came out. I stopped, put it back in, went on my way. Now, once I got to six pins, I tried to buy another set of these pins. Unfortunately, they were out of stock. Apparently, another gentleman that same day came in, he was going down the highway, and his bag came off. Now, like I said, luckily when I came off, I was in traffic. Basically, I was in traffic, bag came off, I actually didn't hear it immediately. I heard the bag dragging behind the bike, turned, noticed it, saw another car actually hit the bag. Luckily it was underneath her bumper and didn't do any damage to her car. So once I got the six pins, they didn't have the pins. I actually got a few zip ties from the guys in the service department, zip tied the bag back on and came home. I immediately looked for a resolution. Now I did find some other videos showing this same fix. And basically what I found was just a simple kit. It's a bolt with a knob on the end and a new clip. Now I don't have the other clip on me. Basically it's similar to this, but it clips on and it has a threaded insert. So this goes through the bag and now it screws into place. It doesn't just twist into place. Now, this seems a lot more secure than this little turn. Now, I haven't taken it out, I haven't tested it, but I can tell you this. This isn't going to come off without you noticing it. You'll be able to check this. You'll be able to see that this is loosening up before anything happens. Not to mention, it does come with a lock washer. So if you don't want this thing to move, it's not going to move. You need to take them off. It's as simple as unthreading it. Now, it's a pretty, pretty simple install. Basically, take the old pins off, take the bags off, take a flathead screwdriver, pop this spring system out of place, and a new clip fits right into it. Took about 10 minutes altogether, and that was with me moving the camera around to get a few shots of you guys. But all in all, definitely something if you didn't know about, definitely something to look into. This system here is Easy Lock, but I will link in the description below. I did find some other systems that were quite a bit more expensive, wouldn't got here as fast. I like to use Amazon Prime, two day shipping and I'm back on the road. The bike needs to get washed. I'm going to take the rest of the afternoon. I'm going to wash and wax it and uh, probably go for a ride tonight. But I just want to shed some light onto that. If you guys already know, cool. If you don't, now you do.
Anyways, guys, thanks for tuning in. Like I was saying earlier, I spent the uh, rest of the afternoon washed, waxed, and polished the bike up. I'm going to take a nice little cruise, grab some grub, maybe come home and finish editing a video. Who knows, though? It's kind of an amazing evening right now. It said it was supposed to rain, but I don't see a cloud in the sky, so... This might be just too nice. I might have to keep on cruising, but we'll see how it goes. In the meantime, thanks for tuning in. Now you guys know about those pins. I was unaware until this bag came flying off. Anyways, you guys have a good one. I'll catch you on the next video.